Good morning, guys. It is sunny and bright, but oh, so cold. I don't think we are uh, hitting freezing yet this morning. I think we're sitting somewhere around 20, 26, 28 degrees. It is, it's cold, but boy, is it pretty. It has been a cold morning. Haven't really had a lot of ambition to do a whole lot. Plus, it's my husband's birthday. So he likes to uh, have lazy days on his birthday. I don't blame him, so do I. And uh, I think right now I'm feeding, watering, got that bottle baby fed, but I would really like to run these girls today and see who is or isn't actually bred because um, we're down to, see Saturday Sunday Monday Tuesday Wednesday so we're five days five days to the end of lambing <laughs> and I'm not sure we're gonna get any more and if that's the case I want to throw a ram in with these guys like today uh, the other everything else will be done next weekend but I would really like to just catch that last little early breeding early late late early breeding I don't know anyway I would like to get a ram in um, I know there are at least five of these I will not be keeping and I might just leave them and leave the ram in with them it doesn't matter if they're bred or not when I sell them they'll go for the same price at the sale so I think if, I, if there is anything that is bred, I may stick them in this alleyway just to kind of keep them out of the road. Uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm still debating, I'm still thinking about it, I'm still running ideas through my head. But it will be a, uh, hopefully later this afternoon when it warms up project, or maybe a tomorrow project, we'll see. Haven't really decided. I'd like to do it today, but if it doesn't get done till tomorrow, I'm really not out anything. I think we are town bound. Uh, he wants to take radar. Oh, it's behind the pickup, you can't see it. And take it to town so that he can get the fender wells cut out so that he can get a seat in there and then weld some stuff and do some stuff and whatever. And then I think tomorrow, We'll, we're just going to throw a ram in with those ewes. We just have to decide which ram. So we need to tow it out of the snowbank that it's in. And it doesn't want to start now. He thinks the starter went boom. I'm not really sure how we're going to get it on a trailer. But uh, yeah, that's the project for right now. So we're not putting it on a trailer. In the back, okay. He was looking for his light, his headlight. But it has a solid tow me, tow me, tow me, what is it, a tow bar? Tow bar. Tow bar, so that we don't have to have somebody sit in it. Because when he told me he we were towing it, I was not a happy camper, because I hate towing stuff. <laughs> but I'm good now. Good morning guys. It is cold. It is frosty. It is uh, like 19 degrees and I lost my gloves last night. So my hands are uh, a tad bit chilly. I think I push them, put them in my pocket and they might have fallen out when we pushed sheep in last night. They actually brought themselves in last night, 
but they were in the alleyway so we kind of had to jump a couple fences to get to them to push them in <clears throat> and uh, I think I might have lost them going over one of those fences so I was too lazy to start the pickup this morning to drive down here so I just walked down now I'm headed to the shop to warm up just a little bit then go look for my gloves feed the lamb and then probably I think the only thing I have on the list of to-dos today is to get sturgeon in with those ewes. We are five days with no lambs and uh, that's a long time with no lambs. So I'm thinking, you know, yeah, we have the potential of those last couple that got bred on the very last day. I'm still gonna throw the ram in. It's fine, mama. We're just helping you out. What do we got going on? Are you having a baby or are you stuck in a hole? If you're not having a baby, because you have no udder, so you're stuck in a hole. <sighs> really? It's not even that big a hole. Too much wool, but I'm not shearing them when it's 10 degrees out. Yeah, I just checked my phone. It's dropped to 10 degrees. It's not 19 anymore. It's a little chilly. So, yeah, I think it's just time to put the ram in and uh, cut my losses. Better? Got your wits about you? Not really. Well, I traced my tracks from last night when we pushed the sheep in and I can't find my gloves. And I think what bothers me most, I don't remember picking a bump off the dash of the car when we came down here. I, they should have been sitting there because I don't remember grabbing them when we went to push the sheep in. So if my memory is getting that bad, what the heck did I do with them? Finally got some heaters going in these two tanks. Oh, I hate the mess. It just drives me nuts, but where I don't have any outlets right in these spots, and I don't have that done yet, this is my only option. Well, it's official. I have lost my ever-loving mind. Found my gloves. I, I don't remember taking them out of my pockets. I don't remember taking them out of the car. I don't remember having them at all last night. But I must have, or they wouldn't be here. Oh, damaged brains are fun. Sturgeon, you're my last hope, man. Ready, Freddy? Oh, he says, heck yeah. Uh-oh. Hey. Dude, run right away. Come on. Come on. Sturgeon, you were close, but you forgot to wait for the gate to open. Come on. Come on. Come on. Dude, you're doing so good, man. Come on, Bubba. Come on. Okay, well, fall lambing has turned into very late fall breeding. Yep, don't have a clue whether this is a good idea or a bad idea. Huh? It's an idea. Well, if we're feeding, we just will be feeding for a reason. Yep. 